Windham, Ohio. Windham is a village in Portage County, Ohio, United States. It is formed from portions of Windham Township, one of the original townships of the Connecticut Western Reserve. The population was 2,209 at the 2010 census. In 1942, the U.S. government chose Wyndham as the site of an army camp for workers at the newly built Ravenna Arsenal. As a result, Wyndham experienced the largest increase in population of any municipality in the United States between the 1940 and 1950 censuses, the population increased from 316 residents to 3,946. Wyndham is part of the Akron Metropolitan Statistical Area. Owing to its location, which is slightly closer to Youngstown than Akron and significantly closer to Warren, Attaway, even closer to Wyndham than the county seat of Ravenna, the village also positions itself in relation to cities in the Youngstown Warren Boardman, OPA Metropolitan Area. Accordingly, the Soul Bank in Wyndham holds membership in the Youngstown Warren Regional Chamber of Commerce. Prior to 1811, the land now comprising the village and township of Wyndham was owned by Caleb Strong, as part of his holdings through the Ohio Company of Associates. On September 11, 1810, a group of 16 men met in Beckett, Massachusetts at the home of Thatcher Conant to discuss the purchase of Londine, Ohio for settlement. These men, who would be known as the Beckett Land Company, consisted of Conant, Elijah Alford, Nathan Burchard, Gideon Bush, Dillingham Clark, Elijah Clark, Isaac Clark, Benjamin Higley, Aaron P. Jagger, Enos Kingsley, Jeremiah Lyman, Bill Messenger, Ebenezer Messenger, Benjamin C. Perkins, John Seeley, and Alpheus Streeter. On November 11, 1810, the Beckett Land Company purchased about from Caleb Strong. The land was divided into 100 lots, and allotted according to each family's investment in the company. Conant, his wife Elizabeth, Dillingham, and Abigail Clark, and Alpheus and Anna Streeter donated portions of their allotments near the center of the township for a village green, which was common practice for townships in the Connecticut Western Reserve. The group of 16 families then departed from Massachusetts on May 2, 1811. Six weeks later, they arrived in the Purchase Survey Township, which was located immediately south of Nelson Township in the Connecticut Western Reserve. This new township, known today as Wyndham Township, was Survey Town 4 and Range 6 of the Western Reserve. The first religious service in the new township was held on July 28, 1811, in the home of one of the settlers. This service was very likely Congregationalist, as several of the families belonged to the Congregational Church in Beckett, Massachusetts. The Congregational Church eventually constructed a building once green, and today the church still remains on the green as a member church of the United Church of Christ. The Wyndham Historical Society notes that the township was originally named Strongsburg, however, some sources cite the original name as Strongsboro. The namesake was original landowner Caleb Strong, who was by then the governor of Massachusetts. There is some discrepancy in how this township can be known as Wyndham. According to the Wyndham Historical Society, the name of the township was changed to Sharon, by an act of legislature in about 1820. A few years later, the name was again changed to Wyndham, which it has remained to present. The Historical Society also cites political concerns as the reason the name was changed from Strongsburg to Sharon. However, on Wyndham Township's website, March 2, 1813 is cited as the date on which the township was made a district by itself and the name was changed to Sharon. The website goes on to state that in 1820, by an act of legislature, the name was changed again to Wyndham. Yet another source, the Ohio Gazetteer, and Travelers' as Guide states that the name was changed from Sharon to Wyndham in January, 1829. Still another source places these dates as 1817 and 1820, respectively. Common to most sources are a few claims which reasonably can be ascertained to be fact. A private academy was chartered in Wyndham on February 19, 1835. Wyndham Academy was the 44th to be chartered by Ohio. This school closed in 1853, and was replaced by a second short-lived private school in the 1860s. Wyndham High School was founded in 1883, across the street from the present school building. The village of Wyndham was incorporated in 1892, and on October 12, 1993 the village officially withdrew from Wyndham Township. In 1940, the United States Department of the Army reserved in eastern Portage County for the construction of two facilities one of these was the Portage Ordnance Depot which with its twin facility the Ravenna Ordnance Plant became known as the Ravenna Arsenal. 
Over 14,000 people were employed at the arsenal during World War II, and the village of Wyndham was chosen as the site to house many of these workers. Wyndham experienced a population boom as a result, its growth of over 1,100% was the largest of any U.S. municipality in the 1950 census, as was reported in the June 1951 edition of National Geographic magazine. Wyndham is located at 41.238706, minus 81.036731. According to the United States Census Bureau, the village has a total area of all land. Interstate 80 and the Ohio Turnpike pass through the village, although there is presently no interchange in either Wyndham or Wyndham Township. Wyndham's location on the toll highway, however, has in recent years caused an expansion of 3G wireless communication services for the people of Wyndham. As of the census of 2010, there were 2,209 people, 786 households, and 598 families residing in the village. The population density was. There were 1,045 housing units at an average density of. The racial makeup of the village was 91.2% white, 4.5% African American, 0.2% Native American, 0.2% Asian, half a percent from other races, and 3.5% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 1.3% of the population. There were 786 households of which 45.5% had children under the age of 18 living with him, 39.9% were married couples living together, 29.0% had a female householder with no husband present, 7.1% had a male householder with no wife present, and 23.9% were non-families. 20.0% of all households were made up of individuals and 6.5% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.80 and the average family size was 3.14. The median age in the village was 31.6 years. 31.1% of residents were under the age of 18, 11.3% were between the ages of 18 and 24, 24.8% were from 25 to 44. 23.4% were from 45 to 64, and 9.6% were 65 years of age or older. The gender makeup of the village was 46.8% male and 53.2% female. As of the census of 2000, there were 2,806 people, 959 households, and 729 families residing in the village. The population density was 1,321.4 people per square mile. 511.0 per square kilometer. There were 1,143 housing units at an average density of 538.2 per square mile, 208.2 km. The racial makeup of the village was 92.94% white, 4.92% African American, 0.21% Native American, 0.07% Asian, 0.18% from other races, and 1.67% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 0.43% of the population. There were 959 households out of which 45.8% had children under the age of 18 living with him, 43.5% were married couples living together, 27.1% had a female householder with no husband present, and 23.9% were non-families. 19.5% of all households were made up of individuals and 6.3% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.93 and the average family size was 3.31. In the village, the population was spread out with 35.9% under the age of 18, 10.2% from 18 to 24, 29.2% from 25 to 44. 17.0% from 45 to 64, and 7.7% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 28 years. For every 100 females there were 89.5 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 81.6 males. The median income for a household in the village was $31,630, and the median income for a family was $32,679. Males had a median income of $30,791 versus $20,859 for females. The per capita income for the village was $11,875.
about 23.5% of families and 23.8% of the population were below the poverty line, including 37.1% of those under age 18 and 9.0% of those age 65 or over. Wyndham has regular public transit bus service on the weekday Portage Area Regional Transportation Authority route from Ravenna, that also services Garrettsville and Hiram in eastern Portage County. Wyndham Exempted Village School District operates one elementary school, one middle school, and Wyndham High School. Wyndham has a public library, a branch of the Portage County District Library. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.